get down to the last four, Cliffy, it's a lot more than skill set. It's a lot more than hitting the shots. It's the intangibles. How are you going to deal with pressure? And how are you going to deal with the expectations? Coco will have the crowd, this New York crowd, behind her, which she loves. She loves the big stage. She embraces crowds. She loves the attention. And, you know, I think she's out here to show her best tennis. That's the team. That's a good one. That's a really good drop shot from Coco Goff. And another easy Goff game on her serve. It's four games to one in the first set. Walk in the park for Coco so far. 22 points to nine overall. She's got a couple of break points here. Again, only the seventh 15, time 15. she's approached the net. Muhova, Coco has just kept her pinned to the baseline. But look at that. She sensed an opportunity, came in and hit behind. Coco was going the other way. Oh, well, well. 5-1, remember. Look for all the world like this was toast for over, but not so. It's 5 4 now. Six games to play. Well, well, he's he's away from the spot in the championship match on Saturday. Well, the coaches can't believe it. Mahova's already off the court, and now Coco debating. Yeah, the tournament director. It's going to be another four, five or ten minutes, they said. Cliffy. Okay. He's had hey. practice balls, right? Pam. Thank you, Coco. Hey, team, um, both players have been told it's okay if they need to leave the court. This will not be charged as one of their bathroom breaks or wardrobe changes. So Mahova's taking advantage of it. Coco's decided as of now not to. BG was telling her just to hit a few serves and actually sorry Brad yeah. Uh, yeah. Coco is coming off. Yeah. All right we'll take a break maybe the protesters have got what they wanted a short delay maybe actually not that short a delay. So it has been uh, a long time 41 plus minutes since the environmental protester uh, glued his feet we understand to the cement floor so they did not want to move him for fear of hurting him obviously so all that time that has elapsed was to find a way to get him out safely that has been accomplished now and the players have been told that when they're ready they can come on out and resume this play Chrissy and then meanwhile Maria Vago who's the physio of Coco Golf just giving her a little workout here trying to warm her up, get those feet moving, get the blood flowing.
opportunity for a relatively easy pass, but that was very strong volleying there from Mukova. 30 love. Yeah, that was good consistency for Coco's forehand as well. Hit a good six, seven forehands there. But now you see Thank you. how crisp that volley of Muhova, and she has to get in more. Yeah, her abdominal muscles will flare up at times because that's been the main focus of her injuries. You saw a, a picture where her trainer was massaging the stomach muscles, and that's, you know, from stretching when you're serving and kind of wonder if that's why she's not giving it 100% on her serve. Easy running, good anticipation from Goff. Still game point. And she holds, so we're even at three apiece in the second set. Only the second. She's up 4 3. I mean, that's a serve volley attempt here, Chrissy, but this volley was just like in the middle of the court for an easy pass. Unless you serve volley all the time, that is hard to control the drop first volley. It came within, I don't know, a fraction of clipping the net. In which case, she would have lost the point. <sighs> Seems like we've been here and done that. The first set was just the same. The question now is whether Caroline can hold serve here. Just talk about the athleticism and the volleys, but look at the shot she came up with. She hooked that with feel and touch. Best tennis yet. And game. game look over, so five, five apiece here in the second set. Game points for Goff. A 6 5 lead. It's Mohova again six, at 5 six, 6 to try to stay in this I'm match.
advantage goal. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.